It's my face, it's not a mask! <laughs> Sorry. Since Halloween first came to our screens, the famous mask worn by Michael Myers has changed over the years quite a lot. 2022 with Halloween Ends just released, we have another one. Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me. My name is Carl and welcome to an unboxing video. Today's video is all about unboxing this, the brand new Michael Myers mask from the movie Halloween Ends. The box is quite big, you probably noticed. The reason for that is I've also ordered the replica knife from the movie Halloween Ends as well. Now that knife, I'll be interested to see what that is actually like. It has completely sold out. Now we're looking for a nice old rusty effect on that knife. So it'd be interesting to see what that knife's like. Both the knife and the Michael Myers mask from the movie Halloween Ends are taken from the mold used in the movie Halloween Ends. So we're looking for a really good quality mask and a quality knife as well. They should be because I've ordered them from Mad About Horror. I own three other Michael Myers masks. I have done unboxing videos for all those masks if you're interested in watching that. If we go back to the original mask from the original Halloween movie, that arrived really rubbish packing. It was almost open, as if someone's tried it on. Since then, I've gone with a company that probably many of you will know, and it's called Mad About Horror. The logo is there, just in case you're wondering what company it is. You can Google them. They are an absolute fantastic company. I've used them ever since I found them. The packaging is top class. As you'll see when I open this box up and they dispatch their items as soon as they are in stock. So I can't fault mad about horror one bit. The Michael Myers mask from the movie Halloween Ends comes in at £64.95 and the replica knife which is inside this box, fingers crossed it should be, is sold out and that comes in at £19.95 but they may get them back in stock. Okay, let's get this unboxed. Before I begin this unboxing, I've done the best I can on the camera. I've zoomed out as far as I can so the box actually fits in. And the reason for that is you guys get to see exactly the same time as me what I am unboxing. This is how I like to do my unboxing videos because if there are items damaged inside or it is the wrong item sent, I will keep that camera rolling and you will see, like I say, the same time as me. Hopefully everything will be perfectly okay because I'm a I have full confidence in Mad About Horror. Unlike the other unboxing I did last week with the 1995 to 2002 4K set. That was damaged inside, but that of course is another video. When I get this unboxed, the Halloween Ends mask, we are looking for a really old, battered Michael Myers mask. So let's get this unboxed. Just cutting the tape on the side. And lifting the lid up. And that, if I turn it to the camera, that is how it comes packed. As I said, I don't have any quarrels with Mad About Horror at all. They know what they're doing there. So, the first thing it comes with is this card. And if we spin it round, we've got a brilliant postcard of Michael Myers there. That's pretty cool. We've also got some advertising. Mm. 
We have an invoice. Now this one's going to be the knife on top, so I'm going to leave that there. Take the mask out. So inside the empty box, we've got some bubble wrap to keep it all nicely packed. It doesn't look damaged, which I'm hoping it isn't, and it doesn't look damaged at all. So it comes in this bag. It's slightly different to the last mask. As I said, I line all the masks up at the end and you can see this is, if I can get it right, sorry, it's very awkward. There you go, to the camera. I will show you with it on so you know what it looks like. If we knock it round to the side, we've got this white stuff on, it's completely battered. We've got the official merchandise logo of Halloween ends. And if we spin it around to the other side, the other side, you can see the scar. It's cleared up now because it's been a while since the last movie, Halloween Kills. So we've got the scar that's all cleared up and it's just a nice effect. It's, it's not too different to my previous mask. And I'll show you what that looks like when I get it in shape in a moment. So let's move that to the wall to the side and let's concentrate on the replica knife as well. It's wrapped in bubble wrap so it's all good. As I expected, an old, rusty, dirty looking knife. Both these items are made from the mold of the movie itself. It's, obviously it's plastic, <laughs> it's not real. They wouldn't be able to do that. The handle is well detailed. As you can see if I can get away from that glare. It's a pretty freaky knife, if I must say so. It's labelled Halloween ends up the top here. If we spin it round, there's nothing on the back other than Halloween ends as well. And we've got the ties where it's tied in. And that's the official replica knife of Halloween Ends. So this is what the Michael Myers Halloween Ends mask looks like on. I just wish I had a bigger head or loads of hair to actually fill the mask. I'm going to do the best I can. If I turn my head to my left hand side, you can see the side of the mask. As I said earlier, that scar's cleared up and healed. You did get pretty beaten up in Halloween Kills. Now if I turn my head to my right hand side, as you can see there, it's going to fall off. <laughs> and if I tilt my head down, you can see his hair all sticky and battered and messed up. And that is what the Halloween ends. Michael Myers mask looks like on. What I'll do, I'll put this on one of my moulds and you can see what it looks like properly when I take the camera in closer. But as you can see there, it's well detailed. Moving on to his knife. I did show you this just earlier, but I'm gonna 
I've decided I'm gonna probably keep this as it is like this. I know it probably seems a waste, but I've got nowhere really to display it if I take the knife out. Not only that, it has actually sold out as well. So if I keep it like that for now until I decide what I'm actually gonna do with it, let's take you in. You can see the rust on that blade and then the handle, it looks old. It's been through a lot, this knife. Both these items are brilliant. I'm really, really pleased with Mad About Horror. You saw how the packaging came. Can't fault it one bit. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this unboxing video of the Michael Myers Halloween Ends mask and the Halloween Ends Michael Myers knife unboxing as well. Now what I'm going to do now, I'm going to play a short clip of all those masks on my mould, on my moulds, lined up and you can just see the detail of them. These black mannequin heads are the best way to display these masks. They're available on eBay, they're not that expensive either. I'll leave you with some music to take a look at the Michael Myers masks. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you like this video, please do give it a like. Also, don't forget to share and subscribe if you can. Thank you so much, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.